Welcome back to Central Valley Weddings. I'm your substitute host today, Mike Briggs, sitting in for the regular host. And we introduce you to weddings and events. Do you have a wedding coming up, an event, a, a party, a family reunion, a quinceanera? Uh, whatever you have, our guests, our vendors who are on the shows can help you out, help you get ready for it, help you execute your event and make sure it comes out great. What's more important to a bride on her wedding day What's most important is the makeup, would you say? Our guest is Jacqueline. Tell me your whole name. Hey, Jacqueline Marquis Villarreal. Marquis Villarreal. <laughs> is it pretty important on that day, I guess, getting the uh, makeup just right? Yes, because you want to, um, your wedding is, you want to make that statement. You want mm -hmm. to tell, you know, show people what you're feeling that day. Some people have theme weddings or different ideas of how they want to look. It goes along with picking your gown. You want your makeup to go right along with that. Now, I have found a lot of people do their own makeup every day. And on the wedding day, things get a little hectic and a little busy. Yes. And I bet it's nice to have somebody to come in and do it. Yes. It's convenient because I'm mobile. I go to you. I go to your venue, wherever you're at. I um, help you get ready, your bridesmaids ready, your mother of the bride, mother of groom ready. But also, wedding day makeup is different than everyday makeup. Mm. I apply false lashes. So in your ah. photographs, your eyes are standing out. It, it has to be the perfect balance of not looking overdone. But if you're under done it doesn't you don't your dress out do, does you your guests might even outshine you so you want to make sure you look complete and like i said make that statement a lot of photos going on bright lights and flashes yes. so the makeup has to help with that it needs that. to last all day also that's all day yeah. a lot of makeup i use is waterproof lasts all day and i've heard so many stories of the brides and the bridesmaids and the moms all going to some little shop somewhere and all having to sit and wait their turn wait their turn but you go to the go to the venue Yes, I go to the wedding venue or your home, wherever you're most comfortable. And then I can also, if it's a large wedding party, um, schedule um, them out. So I can time frame them. I need about 35 um, minutes per person. So I schedule them out and I can tell people uh, when to show up. So not everyone has to be there at the same time. If they're getting their hair done, we can, we can work out the time. Who goes last usually? Um, the bride um, usually goes second to last. Okay. So um, if a bridesmaid wants to go last or the mother of the bride or the grandmother or the mother of the groom, it goes last because I find when the bride goes last, we're in a panic mode yeah. and I like to have a little more time with her and I like her to be calm and have a lot of time. So. And does the makeup time ever become a little party between the, uh, the wedding party? Oh, yes. I have many um, brides, bridesmaids who are um, having mimosas and having food and enjoying their time. So... I'm definitely making sure that we're on time. I'm the timekeeper time. and the makeup artist. <laughs> yeah, keep things moving on time. Yes, I do. Now, you do more than just weddings. You do quinceaneras or? Yes, quinceaneras, um, senior portrait makeup, prom makeup. Oh, yeah. um, get, if you're also going to be a guest at a wedding, I've done many times. Guests like to look very good and formal weddings, they get their makeup done beforehand. So actually any event, um, okay. the costume parties, I've done Great Gatsby yeah. theme makeup. Oh, yeah all types of makeup okay so if you're gonna to go to an event you want to be made up and there's a real art to makeup a lot yes. of people just don't know how to do it yes. which is okay but yes. for that special <laughs> event where you want to look really really hot, hot yes maybe I shouldn't have said hot you want that sex appeal, <laughs> sex appeal there you go. <laughs> um, now if somebody is gonna get married back to weddings uh, when should they contact you like the week before well um, ideally, as soon as they have their wedding date and they have so all their months bridesmaids, and months and months in advance, they can yeah. schedule me a year ahead, a few months. Mm -hmm. I had um, someone call me last minute, a day ahead. I did their makeup eight in the morning. Oh boy. I'm flexible. If I'm available, I'm if you're available. I'm ready. So as far as they want or as late as yeah. notice as they want. But if they don't schedule ahead, they might not get her, may not get Jacqueline. So, uh, yeah, do it a year ahead or eight months ahead or yeah, six months or ahead. A month. When you set your date or when you're buying your dress, be thinking of all your vendors and be contacting all of them. Now, would you have, uh, do you show them books or pictures for ideas or do you just know what to do? I have um, a Facebook page where they can see tons of photos. I have Instagram. Um, but also, um, I ask them usually to show me what they want and then I can definitely recreate that. But if they want to look at my work, they can check it out on Facebook, Instagram. Um, I am putting together a photo, uh, like a portfolio album, because I, I think some people do want to see photos in person, which is fine. Um, so there's always, but their phone, if they have a look, emulate a celebrity or someone else or a bridal magazine, I can definitely um, do that. I have a large kit full of makeup. I bring everything. I bring a chair. I bring um, everything with you me. Bring so I have everything. more so than enough makeup. They don't, makeup. Have to worry about they don't need anything. to worry about anything. You'll show up 
They don't have to show up. You'll show up there. You'll bring everything that's needed. We're looking at some things. Is this yes. your uh, Facebook page? Yes, this is my Facebook. I just did a maternity shoot the other day. Um, she was. I got a very happy review from her. She felt beautiful and lovely. Mm -hmm. She was um, pregnant and did a photo shoot, so I did her makeup for that. So I did, any every girl wants so to look beautiful. Yeah, if so. somebody's going to have a portrait done, that's a good time yes. to get some makeup done. Yes, Whether it be portrait. a senior portrait mm -hmm. or a uh, uh, maternity portrait, maybe yep. an engagement photos. Yeah, I've done a lot of engagement yeah. photos. Matter of fact, I do, um, I, a lot of people sometimes want a trial if their wedding's a year ahead. So I tell them to schedule the trial on their um, bridal shower day yep. or their engagement photo day. That way they can see my work and then they usually book me right after that because they're usually happy with that. How should they start reaching you? Is there a website or a Facebook? What's the best way um, to begin? You can call or text me on my phone number, 559-250-3200 is a good way. Or if they want to check out my pictures, go on Facebook okay. and leave me a message. What would they type in Facebook to find you? Uh, Flawless Faces by Jacqueline. Flawless Faces by Jacqueline. Yes. And if you're trying to find her and you can't find her, call me. I have her Facebook. I had it open on my computer this morning. And uh, it's pretty easy to find flawless faces. And you want to have a flawless face, I guess, when you go for your yes, wedding you or any event. Yes, you do. <laughs> and Jacqueline would uh, take care of that for you. Um, go to her Facebook page. Call her phone number. Here's an email address, Jacqueline. Dot, you could say it better than I uh, can. Jacqueline.marquee75 at gmail.com. And uh, she'll take care of you for your wedding day. It's important. Don't get your friend of a friend who says, oh, no, I can do it. Get a professional that's done it dozens and dozens and dozens yes. of times. And yes. uh, Jacqueline is that person. Yes, and I've uh, worked for MAC Cosmetics for um, since 2003. Wow. So I'm also a certified MAC artist. I work okay. for them um, very, very part-time. I'm basically a freelance artist for them. And then I have my own business. So I'm mm -hmm. very well trained. I know what I'm doing. And I'm never late. And I am always have my brides always on time there. for their wedding. Yep. Yeah. She's in charge of the makeup session, moves them through on time so yes. the wedding starts on time. <laughs> Anything else you want to add? No, but just uh, feel free to look me up on Facebook or contact me and I can meet with you and do a, a trial. Very good. Uh, we will be back with more of the Central Valley Wedding Show right after these messages.